Hi, Dave. I like your shirt. <laughs> I just spilled a bunch of mineral cum. You getting some mineral cum? Mm -hmm. Apparently, I didn't drink it all last night. So, so you have a topic today for, or, yeah. or, okay. What will be our topic today? Well, I was going to talk about uh, piriformis uh, syndrome. Mm. That's a good one. Yeah, I didn't have, I didn't make a flyer. That's all or, right. Okay, but I, I just sent them a notice. This is our first time change it to Friday. Maybe they maybe give giving some <laughs> time to them. Well maybe they maybe they will forget. You know, I didn't I didn't prepare any uh, briefing slides or anything, but I thought I would oh that's an interesting background. Where are you? I'm um, I'm at uh, the coffee shop called the wider. <laughs> yeah, where is that located? Looks nice. It's at uh, let's see here. It's 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 what did I say? It's on Spinar. It's on Spinar. Yeah, Spinar and yes, and Macray Road. Uh, okay. It must be new. I'm not familiar with it. Oh, it's called the Widers Block Bookstore and ca Cafe. Okay. Yeah, they serve like alcohol, co coffee. They have books here you can read. <laughs> uh, they serve food too. That's really comfortable. A oh, nice place to sit down and have a a chat and uh, and. Yeah, so I just, uh, I, I did so many today, don't have time to go home to do the Zoom. So I just come to the coffee shop. But I just help uh, Ava sign up another associate. <laughs> Is that <laughs> right? Ava signed up an associate, huh? Yeah, so. Now, where's, yes. where's Eva? Look? Did Eva end up underneath me or is she uh, yes. someplace She's, else? She should be under you. Under me, okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I must have had a lot of mineral corn. <laughs> oh, you still feel uh, sleepy? Oh, I, I made some last night. But I don't think I have to and when I pushed okay. my computer up against the, the wall, it knocked the, the little coffee cup that I've got. This one right here, knocked it over. Oh no. <laughs> yeah. Are you sure you're just having mirror comps? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe I was a little tired last night. <laughs> How's your work uh, at Thailand? Oh, it works great. Yeah. Yeah. I see some uh, video moms show me. That you're turning down a house, or or that's what you're gonna build for the embassy? No, no, we're we're tearing down a whole block of buildings, and we're almost wow. done. We've only got one big off. One, well, it's a it's an old supermarket that we're tearing down. The next one. Mm. Oh, how many buildings are on the block? Well, there used to be like hundred and twenty. Now there's just one. Oh, okay. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Uh, so if you can imagine, imagine a uh, uh, small city block. This was it's off of the main highway, city block. Um, 
and it's, you know, we have to clear the site. Uh, it's pretty much cleared. Uh, mm -hmm. There you go. Thekla was in touch with me, and she has a friend named Stephanie. Mm -hmm. Let me check my phone again. Who? Uh, Yeah. Yeah, she was on Health Eagle. Zoom. Maybe, maybe let me get our record. I want to call that class to see if she can make it. Maybe she forgot the meeting today. Yeah. Okay. She said she had Sandy. Her friend was name was Sandy. Uh huh. And she was suffering. Okay, I just call her. Maybe she she's busy right now. Um, they are not oh. <laughs> okay. Let's see here, that's better. Maybe. <laughs> here. Yeah. So today I um set mom to work and then the morning uh. So I have, I have, so we, we, we were trying to new, new agent again. <laughs> so he's a, a new agent. Oh, yeah. new sales agent. Yeah. So the, the Chinese agent, she's not really responsive. So now uh -huh. I found a different, different agent. He's, uh, uh, I know him before through uh, work venture, but he, he's mm -hmm. in a different, he's a different team uh, now. He's, he, he's no longer to work one check because it's bankrupt already. Um, so right now he doing the real estate agent and then uh, and then remodeling. He have a remodeling company and his wife doing a spa, uh, spa salon business. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so so he show mom uh, his, uh, her spa. Oh, okay. I got it. Sorry, I get a phone call, Rookie. Oh. Okay.
Hey, David. Sorry, you know what happened there. <laughs> so how are you doing? I'm good. How are you doing, David? Oh, tired. I'm doing super. Working a lot. Go in early, get off late. Oh, well, tomorrow, then I'll have Sunday off. Yeah. So you're gonna, they're going to make you go in tomorrow, too? Well, I got enough work. And they paid me double time to do it. So, yeah. You can't beat that. No, I can't beat it. Um, no. So I'll go in early. I'll try to go in like five and work till noon. That way it'll seem like I still have a weekend. Um, Gwen's working tomorrow anyway, so um, it works. It'll be fine. Um, I'll have the afternoon to do something. But so, <clears throat> how's, uh, how's life in Thailand? Super. Uh, Ah, uh, tropical? It's, yeah, it's really good. Oh, nice. So, <clears throat> work is going good, or you're all kind of settled in now and doing your thing? I'm into, yeah, I'm into a routine, um, and uh, I've got a place. Yeah. You know. Nice. <clears throat> we'll see you. Got a regular place to meet with the co uh, co-workers after work and oh, okay. um, and then last Monday I had an opportunity to get out into the community actually outside the city uh -huh. and uh, view a whole bunch of things so okay. did a lot of touring so, so where are you at and you're in Chiang, Chiang Mai yeah the place is called Chiang Mai Chiang wow. Mai is up in the northern part of Thailand okay um, we're about uh, Oh, two and a half, 200 miles away from Miramar and about 400 miles away from Laos. Oh, okay. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well, sounds kind of interesting. Sounds like. Uh, yeah, there's uh, mountains all around and uh, we're in a, we're in a valley. Oh, okay. Um, it's starting to rain. So we're getting uh, the rainy season's beginning. Oh, so it's the start of the rainy season. It's the start of the rainy season. Actually, it's the rainy season officially is supposed to start in August. Um, but we had our first full day of rain yesterday. Oh, okay. But it's it's kind of overcast yet sunny today. Oh, okay. Hmm. So we've got overcast, not windy and cloudy. I drove down to Moose Pass today for work, so so it was <clears throat> not a bad drive. So. You went down yeah. to Moose Pass. That's a heck of a nice drive. Yeah, it's a nice drive. It takes most of the day, though. I left at 9.30, got back at 3.30, and then finished work at five, or a little after almost 5 or whatever it was, 4.45, and then drove home. So, <clears throat> well, that's why mm. I was late. So. What happened to Mila? Yeah. Well, she said she had to take a phone call. Um, oh. We were trying to get a hold of Thecla. She was interested in today's topic with a friend of hers named Sandy. Okay. And uh, you ever suffered piriformis uh, syndrome there, Dave? Uh, if, what, I don't even know what that is. Back in, in well, back. quite, quite, quite frankly, uh, that's a good thing that you don't know. Okay. You know, but it's it essentially uh, mimics. Uh, spinal sciatica. Oh, okay. So it's pain in your lower back, pain in your butt, and pain all the way down one or both of your legs, depending upon how you've inflamed your uh, sciatic nerve. Oh, so my my most recent pain in the ass is from just falling down on my 
uh, on my uh, rollerblades the other day. So. <laughs> I came home and I, and accused Gwen of. of uh, I of can't. I, I can't say that I've had a pain in the ass in a while. But. I, oh, Gwen, I don't have that good a life insurance, so we shouldn't be taking up skydiving. But um, <laughs> so we went. That was my our latest adventure. Hello, Hello, Mila. You're muted. You're muted. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Sorry, I, I, I'm back. <laughs> so I was talking to one of my PC. He after he using products for one month. Right now, he feel like so much energy. He feels so much better. So he's gonna jump on uh, real quick to talk to us. Okay. So I invited Fantastic. him to. Yeah. So his name is uh, Ling Jiang. He said he's, he's a clink, clink, uh, clink He said he used to be a, a like keynote speaker for the native tribe or yeah. over 100 different tribe. Does he's he speaking Anchorage or did, does he live in Southeast? Uh, he lives in Anchorage. Oh, okay. Yeah, he said he's a, like a keynote speaker and leader. Um, that's what he used to do. He, oh, okay. he uh, for living is to teach and, and speak in front of a lot of people. <laughs> oh, nice. yeah. mm. oh, you cannot hear it? Yeah. Hello, Tecla. I can barely hear you. I can see the, the little dog. I can see the big dog. <laughs> but you need to lower it so you get to see your body. Right? Can't can't see your face much. Yeah, that's better. Right, she's having trouble hearing. Am I coming across to all right? You're okay. Mila's okay. I think it looks like Thecla's having trouble hearing. Yeah. She needs to check her uh, speakers. Mm. Let me send her a note. Uh, no. I have to jump off at six. We've got company coming in tonight, so. Oh, great. So then we went down to Kenai with Eric and helped him sign up one of his longtime friends as a preferred customer this last weekend so oh what's his name uh, that was that melanie melanie oh, uh, melody melanie switzer is the was their name it was kind of mm -hmm. cool they had uh, um they had had some chinese students that were here back in 2011 they had sort of tried to keep in touch with and they lost touch with them and and uh, they still had a phone number and they had addresses and stuff, but they didn't know how to get a hold of them. And uh, when we talked about WeChat, so Gwen put, put one of their phone numbers into WeChat and got in touch with him and had this little, whole conversation going on. And, and it was like, oh, they hadn't talked to him in like five or six years. So they were just happier than that. It was, it was pretty cool. It was, it was one of those really kind of neat things. That's so wonderful. <laughs> yeah, that's amazing. Oh, we see a link join us now. <laughs> oh, All right. Let's see here. If you, Lin, Lin, you need to turn on your uh, speaker so we can hear you. Can you hear us okay? Lin? Yeah. Can you hear, hear us you. okay? Goodbye, Leon or Leonard? Uh, Leonard, his name's Leonard, but he go by Len. Len? Oh, okay. Len. Len. Okay. Yeah. He's connecting the audio to see if you can hear us now. Okay, you need to turn, uh, turn on your speaker so we can hear you too. Yeah. So there's a little speaker. Just turn it on on your phone. Or it's Muted. Okay. okay. There, there we go. Me. Now we can hear you. Yay. Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. 
We've got Thecla and then we've got one other person, Mila. Yes, uh, we got one more person who's calling in. <laughs> okay, well, we might as well get started. Um, and uh, Len, it's nice to meet you. Uh, you. You have probably not met me yet. My name is Dave, like this gentleman right over here on, uh, on my left on my screen, but I don't know where he is on your screen. That's David Monteith and uh, Mila and, uh, and Thecla. And we don't know who the other uh, person is. Uh, could that be Sandy? You need to unmute so we can hear from you. No, maybe not. All right, shy. <laughs> All right. So on the uh, on the WeChat and on the Facebook and so forth, I'm the Health Eagle, and currently I'm in Chongmei in Thailand. Wow! So I'm doing some doing some work for the State Department over here. Now, uh, looking at that, then the topic that we were going to, to discuss today was going to be piriformis syndrome. And uh, one of the reasons for talking piriformis is we try to make it topical. And uh, I do have a friend who is, who is suffering from piriformis. And Echel has a friend who's suffering from piriformis syndrome. And uh, it can be quite painful. Now, has any, anybody here had what it had or have what is known as sciatica? Uh, okay. I, I have chronic back pain, but it's not sciatica. Okay. Is, is yours uh, diagnosed as being disc related? That's correct. Yes. Okay. All right. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about myself is, is that I suffered chronic back pain from a long time since my early teens uh, up to about six years ago. And uh, I've had about 26 different uh, uh, cortisone shots in my, uh, my S series spinal. Right? I understand. Okay. Um, in, in addition to that, having a uh, torn disc, uh, dislocated disc, having uh, uh, various different, uh, you know, strains and backs and, and, and that sort of thing. But one of, the, one of the problems that I had was in mixing with all of the real disc problems, there was another big problem. And it took a long time to get diagnosed because of the overlapping disc problems. Hmm. And what that problem was is a piriformis uh, syndrome. And if you've never heard of the piriformis, you have two. Everybody has two of these, right? They're tiny muscles. They're about this long, right? And they control the movement of your hip on both sides, okay? And I wanna hmm. show you a picture of that, Mila. Can you give me control? to do that? I want to show my screen. So I'm going to go to screen, right? And I'm going to go to share. And I will explain, ex, expand this out. OK. OK, can you, can you see that just fine? Yes. OK. Uh, what we're looking at here is the, the dark red that's going out to the side. Those are your piriformis muscles. And what they do is they, they move that rotator of your, of your hip. You know, so for instance, if you move your foot and you twist it out and then you twist it in, it's your piriformis muscle that's doing that. Yeah. Okay, now, now if you can see the yellow uh, on, the, on the picture, there's two yellow streams, one on left leg, one on the right leg, all right? 
Those are your sciatic nerve and they go all the way down to your foot. So it starts out in your S2 and um, between your S2 and your S3 and your S3 and your S4. I, I, and, and I may be talking over anybody, but you, your spine has got numbers, right? Uh, yeah. You've got the sciatic, you've got the lumbar, you've got the cervical, you know, different parts of your, of, of your spine have different numbers, right? So this is starting at the bottom of your spine. If I stand up here, right here, right? You're going to have a little node and then it go up one and that's your S1, okay? Um, and then you can just start counting from there. And it's this, uh, the bones that are numbered and then between the bones are the discs and between the bones and the disc, then the nerve comes out, okay? So this disc there to help cushion the, the, the pressure between the two bones and your nerve. Now the sciatic nerves, they affect both of your legs. That uh, controls all the movement in your leg. So if you've got sciatica, you've got pain, not just at the, the base of your spine, but you've got it shooting all the way down your leg. Okay, and sometimes it is referred to as shooting pain. Sometimes it's a real chronic pain. And sometimes it, it acts like a gigantic um, mechanism for cramps. Okay, and in my particular case, in the middle of the night, I'd get a cramp and I'd be in agony until I'm able to relax enough to get the, uh, the calf cap, uh, cramp loosened up. Now, the problem that you run in with piriformis syndrome is, is that the piriformis, if it gets inflamed, right, um, it will pinch the sciatic nerve right in that hip point right there. You can see it as it goes underneath where you get the little red there, that's the muscle, you got the bone, and then you've got the sciatic nerve. So if that sciatic nerve gets, I mean, uh, agitated, irritated, inflamed, it's gonna it's gonna impact that uh, that nerve. So for instance, if that muscle gets hard, right, every time it tries to move, it's gonna grind that sciatic nerve right against that bone. Okay. So has anybody got any uh, any questions at this point, or uh, I'm you know, but I guess what I want to uh, confer is, is that, you know, this can be very, very painful and it can also be very debilitating. I know that Thecla was telling me earlier this week that she uh, it considered it very uh, paralyzing to have uh, sciatic nerve pain and hers was in the, uh, in the right leg and mine was in the left leg. And I believe a good friend also a uh, USANA family member who is not on this call, who should be, um, actually is currently suffering from it and his is in the left leg. Uh, there are treatments and self treatments that work far better than any kind of medication or shots or uh, and the like. Because I did, well, I did the shots, I did the medications, the painkillers, the muscle relaxants. Uh, and I also did deep tissue massage uh, and I did a chiropractor for a while. Uh, you know, I would get some relief from the acute pain, but I never got the, the release of the pain to be able to heal and recover, okay? Until I was introduced to uh, USANA. And I will, I will tell you that uh, straight off the bat. It wasn't until I was into the USANA products that I started feeling better and getting rid of all of my chronic pain, specifically this back pain that I'd been living with for 40 years. Okay, I don't know, it, you know, for you uh, who don't know me, I'm 64 years old, okay? And uh, 
when I retired from the military, I had to retire. I could no longer work. Okay. I was in so much pain and they taken away my ability to go and be worldwide deployable. I had to live in the States, which is, you know, um, so I decided that it was time for the younger people to take over and then I would go do something else because I wasn't any more um, useful. About six years ago, I've come across USANA. I started taking the products and I'll tell you which ones is that uh, the pain started going away and I started becoming worldwide deployable. And now I've been to Jordan, I've been to Qatar, I've been uh, across the country and now I'm in Thailand. And uh, for those of you who have uh, expectations of the future, uh, mine are to continue working and to see the world and have somebody else pay for it. Okay, so uh, looking at that, there's two components to this. There's stretching, right? And then there's release of the inflammation. Now, if you know your USANA products right off the bat, what's the number one product to take for inflammation? Everybody speak up. <laughs> I know David knows this one. It's one of his favorites. I know it's my favorite. Helped me recover from a broken leg last year. That would be Percosa. That would be Percosa. Absolutely. So, Len, have you are you are you on Percosa yet? Uh, I am just getting started. I just think getting started. All right. I'm going to yeah. introduce you to Percosa because Percosa is a lifesaver. Yeah. And and I will tell you about this is that it's not an air the, the daily dosage is recommended to be three. I usually take one tablet a day and a in a preventative measure. But when I get hurt, you know, in an acute way, whether or not it's a um, a groin pull, a ankle twist, a uh, uh, muscle in the shoulder, um, any kind of joint muscle, soft tissue, right? Where you're going to get inflammation. You need to get at the inflammation and get it released and then also start recovering from the any with from the oxidation that's created by the inflammation. You, so here's here's the thing. So in this particular case with the piriformis, I quadrupled my dose the, the recommended doses. I went from three to twelve a day, right? And it took about a week. Now keep in mind I've been suffering this thing for since I was in my teens, right? And I'm 56 when I started doing this, all right? So there's a good deal of time. So I took about, took about, uh, uh, took about a week and the muscles started relaxing enough and I could start doing the recommended stretches, right? And uh, so now we're gonna do that and then you look at the next one is in your health pack, right? And in your health pack, you've got your mega cal D, right? Calcium for every muscle contraction, magnesium for every muscle relaxation, right? And the D is there to help it absorb into the body, okay? And I, I will tell you that it, it, uh, the scientists at uh, USANA are incredible. Because when I started on the USANA products, everything started changing in my life. And I went down to Salt Lake City and spoke with those boys and girls. And uh, as a matter of fact, I took up a lot of their time <laughs> asking question after question after question. And the formulations of the different nutrition uh, components is the key component of, uh, to me of why USANA works so well. Obviously, you know that it digests. So it actually gets in the bloodstream instead of ends up in your poop out the back, right? So you're not wasting your money. Two is that it actually does what it says and it's, you know, the amount of product or dosage is in the product. So you actually get what you're paying for. Uh, three, it digests, it gets into the bloodstream. And in the Percosa, uh, 
you're getting everything that your muscles and your joints need. Now, Percosa was built for the people with knee pain, right? The design for it was associated with all the glucosamine and chondroitin and, and so forth. But in the standard packages for that, uh, if you took it and if it got into your bloodstream, how would it know where to go? I mean, you're hurting over here, right? Why does it want to go everywhere in your body? Well, that's where your body's putting it, right? So what you need is something special to drag the active components of it to where your inflammation is. And there is a product. It's a, a special product developed by uh, USANA Mariva. Um, and it actually helps the, the product get into the bloodstream. And then what it does, it seeks out the hot in your body, the inflammation, right? So it grabs the product and takes it to the inflammation. So you're getting the maximum amount of dosage of the product where you need it most. You get that? Yes. <laughs> okay. So we're getting into the specifics of how you design this so you get the maximum amount of use. Because I don't want my Percosa in my brain. I don't want my Percosa in my heart unless, of course, I, you know, I need it there. You know, I want it where I hurt. Uh, where my inflammation is. And uh, so I get that with the, with the USANA product. And that's one of the reasons why I only use USANA products is because they think about stuff like that. All right. So anyway, you get this in, in and you're gonna attack this inflammation and you're gonna reduce the inflammation. You're also gonna take your proflavonase C, okay? Which is gonna act upon the oxidation. Right? It's going to take the oxidation out. It's a, it's a huge antioxidant, right? And get it, get it out of the system. Uh, you're going to get your omega cal D for uh, the the muscles uh, throughout your body, and uh, and then you know you've 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 gotten the benefit of everything else that you're you're doing. But those are the three specific ones that I would go to: uh, the CoQ10 and the uh, Biomega are also very helpful in this kind of treatment. So then the next thing is, okay, you're getting the right nutrition, you're getting the inflammation down. Now you're feeling a little bit better, but you don't want this sucker to come back, right? You don't want this pain to come back. So there's a way in which you can perform stretching exercises that will work these piriformis muscles to keep them loose. All right. Obviously, you know, hydration is very important. Uh, you know, the uh, uh, like keeping your electrolytes up. Obviously, USANA has a product for that. Uh, so the you want to keep them the muscles moist. You want to keep them loose. You want to and but you want to stretch them. And if I can show you, this is going to be interesting to see this. Um, I'm going to tilt my Camera down here, right? And I'm going to get down. See, maybe I can get. Let's try this. If I can get the lights on for me, right? Take the leg that doesn't hurt, right? And stick it up on an elevated platform. If you're laying down on the floor, this is best. It's kind of hard to show, but if you can get the, the one leg up and then you take your other leg, the one that hurts, and you pull it across here, just above the knee, grab the foot right here, and then you're going to push on the, on the knee that hurts. And you'll feel that stretch. Now, you're not going to want to stretch so that it hurts. What you want to do is stretch so that it loosens. One of the best uh, tools for this is like a uh, inflated, large inflatable ball. You know, the kind that uh, ergonomics for sitting at your desk or uh, many times uh, therapy uh, places will have them. 
you can roll this way and put, put it underneath here and you roll this leg this way. That helps with the stretch. But you want to work that stretch. And what it does is it works right here underneath the gluteus maximus. So I'll leave that to, to, uh, to work it. Now, if you're suffering on both sides and you want to change, change legs, the other thing that you can do is when you're, before you start walking, right, you're going to do your exercises, you're going to get out and walk, you get up and lean against the wall and stretch out that upper thigh, the calf and the upper uh, thigh up here. And then you can also twist your, twist your hips, all right? Those are the kinds of exercises to, uh, to go forward with to, to stretch out your, um, I don't know, you've probably not even seen what I just did because I forgot to change the screen unless you were able to make your screen. Hmm. Yeah, we, okay, we can barely. We can barely see it, but you're really tiny, though. <laughs> oh, we can see it. <laughs> you can you can see it only because I was really tiny. Yeah. Um, I, is is there need to uh, uh, show that again? Let me get the the design the performance uh, display off the screen here. I saw it okay, um, but I would like the names of those. Uh, the list of those three USANA products that you mentioned. Oh, the USANA products? Yeah. So we're going to start with Procosa, right? Procosa, right? Yes. I love USANA because they name the product strangely, right? Proflavina, Proglucamon. You know, you can't hardly say the words, but uh, they are what they are. It's like we in Alaska, we like to name our things what they are, like Eagle River is because the eagles fly over the river. Bear Valley is because, well, shoot, there's where the bears are. I mean, you know, you want to go on the Glen Highway because you're going to go to Glen Allen. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's that kind of kind of thing. So um, I just, uh, so Percosa is the number one, uh, the Mega Cal D, right? And you'll find the Mega Cal D inside of your health pack, or you can okay. buy it separately, okay? Uh, the combination of the Mega Cal D is calcium, uh, mag uh, mag mag magnesium, and then the D, and it, it absorbs into the uh, into the body. You can never have enough D, by the way, uh, especially up there uh, where your body's not subject to being able to generate its own D. Um, you need to supplement with a lot of D. Um, and then uh, I contacted with Dr. Lad McNamara uh, regarding the performance, and he has uh, a um, a protocol in his uh, in his package for migraine headaches, and he recommended that uh, use the migraine headache protocol for dealing with the pain um, in that. So John, uh, excuse me, uh, Leonard. Uh, Dr. Lad McNamara is a longtime USANA uh, proponent. He's got a lot of protocols for various different illnesses and so forth. And it's uh, it's Lad, Dr. Lad, Dr. Lad, what's it, uh, David? Dr. Lad.com? McNamara, VIP.com. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, we can get you the uh, on that. Uh, you buy a, uh, a membership with him and then all the all of his advice is free. I see. Everywhere. Okay. Yeah. Um but he has a he has a setup for for protocol and in there uh, he's recommending the migraine uh, uh, protocol for uh, paraformance. He also rec recommends the use of uh, tens units. Do you know what a tens unit is? T E N S. No. Anyway, it what it does is it has a controlled electrical shocks and you can actually oh, okay. yeah. Got yeah, it. shock the muscle into relaxation. Yes, I have that. You have one of those. 
I yes. used to have a lot of those. I have yeah. none anymore. <laughs> I don't need those things anymore. Uh, I, I got hurt during my service in uh, Vietnam era. And so I got into a real bad car accident. And what I have is called leaking discs. And uh, it's my L4, L5. L4 L3, and L5. L3, L4, and L5. And so I've been so constant. You're, you're actually on. leaking spinal fluid? Yeah. OK. All right. Uh, on the, uh, the disc component uh, of that, we can talk about that some more, too, is your, your, uh, your Biomega and your, uh, your CoQ10 uh, will help with the lubrication of the discs, right? Yes. Uh, yeah. And depending upon the atrophying of the discs, uh, you can actually moisten them back up so that you don't have as much much problem. Wow. And then the next issue is how much uh, arthritis that you have uh, in your in in you. And then you deal with the arthritis with the perflavonase C because arthritis is what it's an inflammation of the bone, right? Yes. And you just need to cut off the. Uh, uh, the inflammation and keep the arthritis from getting worse, if not better. Now, they're officially, okay, officially, we cannot say that USANA products cure or you know, treat any illness or disease or so forth. But I'm living proof <laughs> that it does, okay? Um, and uh, my whole life changed when I first started in uh, with USANA. Um, I used to wear bifocals. I don't wear glasses anymore. I used to have to wear glasses to read my computer. I had glasses to drive at night. I had special glasses. I don't have bifocals and trifocals. And I'm going, that was one of the first things that uh, uh, improved in me was my eyesight. And that was uh, one of the big reasons for me to go down to, uh, uh, down to talk to the scientists. And, the, uh, and they told me about uh, the fact that they had designed Vision X to treat or to uh, prevent, okay, to prevent macular degeneration. The leading cause of blindness in the United States is macular degeneration. So they were going to uh, uh, try to prevent that. And you know what? In my eyes, they got better. Now, in my wife's eyes, they did not get better. So um, her deterioration obviously was from a different cause or whatever. Thecla, you've got a story. Are you are you able to talk about your story on your eyes? Yeah. Okay. You can't she we can't hear you, Thecla. Yeah, she says she okay. don't have wife she don't have Wi Fi there. So oh she can't she can't talk. Okay. She but hopefully she can listen. Anyway, mm -hmm. she had floaters and she was able to, to do that. She was going to get uh, uh, cardiac, uh, cataract surgery. And they found out that after she started with the Vision X, she didn't need cataract surgery anymore. Wow. Um, you know, as far as, you know, the, the, the bones and, and, and so forth, you know, I'm a, I'm a, real, a real proponent of Percosa. Uh, I was over in Jordan last fall and uh, I broke my leg walking, go figure, right? Uh, the sidewalks and so forth are very uneven and, and, and the like. Uh, and uh, it took me about five days to be able to walk uh, without uh, crutches or anything. And then, uh, and I can, I, you know, it was, I just tripled, double, tripled up on my, uh, on my, Percosa and I added a lot of D to it and got a lot of sunshine on my leg. Um, I would keep it, uh, you know, iced up as much as I could. And uh, you know what? Uh, we were able to do a lot of bone growth. Um, treated my wife with the uh, uh, same kind of thing for bone growth. She needed to grow back palate for her, for her teeth. Wow. And uh, we've had some success with that. So um, uh, you can get there. There's a lot of lots and lots of changes um, that are uh, uh, can be can be affected. Um, I tore my bicipital tendon while I was out at Wake Island 
Uh, and uh, I don't know, Lynn, do you know where Wake is? It's out in the South Pacific. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's a old World War II uh, uh, base that we still maintain and operate. And uh, I uh, I tore my bicipital tendon in my left arm. And so they come back to Elmendorf, right? I'd come up to Elmendorf and uh, the uh, surgeon says, uh, well, you've done a really good job. We're gonna have to operate. Okay, I'm already 58 years old. I don't need uh, to uh, make things any worse. And I finished up working uh, for the Alaska Federal Healthcare Partnership on clinical outcomes and next generation hospital and a whole number of things. And I know that the number one way to go die is to go to the hospital. Yes. I, yeah. Uh, I, I ran the, the 100,000 Live Safe campaign trying to teach doctors how not to kill people. And uh, <laughs> so I said, okay. So uh, with the with my wife's advice and so forth, we decided not to do the surgery. Well, in the uh, the first month, it was like the, the pain went away, and by the second time, it was like I didn't have any uh, any problems. And they had predicted I was going to have all this muscle loss and strength loss and so forth in my arm. And uh, by Uh, see, what happened in, in May, so it was in November, I moved my entire household from Eagle River up to the mountain in, in uh, uh, South Anchorage and uh, in Bear Valley and took me 28 truckloads and I, no problem, right? No great big scar here, no, no, no loss of muscle strength and uh, the uh, bicipital tendon had reattached. Now, I'm not saying that it was the USANA, but the only thing changed in my life was USANA. So, uh, the, uh, the world goes, goes along those, in those directions. So, uh, anybody have any, uh, any questions? Hello, Jerry. And uh, I guess that's uh, over in uh, uh, China, that'd be uh, uh, Jisheng, right? Who else have we got there, Mila? New new people joined us. I think we have. Uh, ah, we have there's Ji Sheng. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> yeah. Hi, Niha. 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 <laughs> okay, so our 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 families truly is worldwide, and uh, so I know Jerry's working. He probably can't say anything. He's. He's probably got somebody watching them work, but we wanted to, to, to say hi there, Jerry, and uh, go back in. Are there are there any questions uh, that you have about piriformis syndrome or uh, you know, the approach to uh, to dealing with that kind of pain, or dealing, you know, talking to somebody else about their pain? Because uh, Many times it is the pain that drives us to go and make changes in our lives. You know, if it weren't for the pain, we wouldn't go and make those changes. Obviously, uh, if you're complacent, right, you're not going to change. But the minute you need it, you, you have some agitation, right, uh, you need to, uh, it causes you to improve or to change your, your condition. So uh, oftentimes it is pain that causes us to change uh, the way we work, the way we play, the way we, uh, we treat ourselves. Okay. No questions? Nope. Yeah, yeah. You had a great uh, presentation. Me. Yeah. Decla, did I, you know, give me a thumbs up, give me a thumbs down. Did I cover what you needed for Sandy? I missed your whole presentation. <laughs> All right. We'll talk about it separately then. Okay. Thanks. Okay. I, yeah. This Maybe Zoom is what, on. Zoom on my phone is not a good idea. <laughs> no, Zoom on your phone is probably not a good idea. But uh, if you, we can do a three-way call, three-way, right, three-way, right, three-way call uh, with Sandy, we might be able to get uh, those uh, those questions answered. Yeah, well, I'll have to schedule something with Sandy, and I don't know when I'll see her next. I don't have her number. Okay, and uh, and Mila, 
um, we, we've got this recorded, so maybe we can throw it uh, 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 towards our friend who, uh, who desperately needs this information. Again, it is as if I haven't trained him on how to do this in the past. He just hasn't listened, hasn't done the precosa part. Okay, you got to do the precosa part to get at the inflammation. Yes, well, this is exactly what I needed. Uh, I've been in pain every day since 1970. Oh, and I, I, I feel for you, Leonard, because when I was blown up as a young soldier, um, and I've lived with that pain till I was well past my retirement, and I'm going. Yeah. It is great not to be in pain. That's what I've asked for. Just give me a day with no pain. A day with no pain. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Coming. And you can get it here on Earth. Right? Yes. You don't have to wait till you die to get to that point. Okay. You can get it here. You just have to. Uh, I mean, you know, and you're I, in the I, right place. Since I've been on USANA, I feel a lot better. The pain is not as bad. So. You know, before I wouldn't have any good days. Now I'm having good days. Oh, fantastic, Leonard. Appreciate that. All right. I've got nothing else, Mila. Uh, David, you got anything to add? No, I'm good for today. Thank you, David. That was good information. All right. That Perfect. Was awesome. yeah. Yeah, thank you, David, for the great presentation. Uh, Thanks, David. I think that's, that's what, all we needed. <laughs> yeah. All right. Uh, well, from Chiang Mai, China, uh, Chiang Mai, China, Chiang Mai, Thailand, right? <laughs> uh, I'm going to say have a great evening for wherever you are. Uh, and then for those of us who say it's Saturday already, uh, I know that I have a full day of, uh, of things to do. Great. Thank you so much. Right, so right. every this is meetings every Friday. So you, so then, then if you like it, you can join us next Friday same time. Okay, thank you for letting me know. This yes. was very great, very good. I enjoyed it. I learned a lot, and I'm gonna get more of that. How do you say it? Percosa. Percosa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nice to meet you, Land. All, All right. right. Cool. See you all, uh, next week. Next week, same time. Right. Yep. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 How do I hang up here? <laughs> you, on the top right corner, there's a leaf. You can click the leaf. Top right corner. Where did the leaf go? <laughs> there's a red button. Did you see it? Oh, the re record? No, the uh, if you're using your phone, so on the top right corner, there's a button saying leave. Oh. You can leave. Okay, I don't see that, but I do see settings. <laughs> <laughs> I'll figure it out. All right, cool. <笑>他说他不知道怎么出去我们就先把这个挂了然后我把这个关了然后我们都可以出去了然后去那个中文的那个号这样我们对这个是英文的号所以我们就过去啊现在下去拜拜拜拜<笑><笑><笑><笑><